Hey, this is Leah with Backyard Homestead in Starkville, Mississippi, and I've been out planting in the garden this afternoon, adding a little bit of color out here, have some impatience put around the border, and I wanted to show our potatoes, and they are doing really well. We planted them in buckets this year because our carrots work so well. Um, we thought we'd go ahead and try potatoes, and plus it was way too wet to get our potatoes out when we wanted to. So we're planting them in buckets, and I showed that earlier. But anyway, they are up and doing well, and we've already covered them with dirt about three or four times. They're almost to the tops of these buckets. Again, these are red Pontiac potatoes in these black buckets on either side of our onion bed. And while I was out here the other day, I noticed some of our onions are starting to swell too. These are the candy onions, and we have the red candy onions and the white candy onions. And there's one that's starting to swell of the red. And there's a white one over here really putting on a show. We find him. Here he is. Here he is. He's starting to swell. So we may get a good crop of onions this year. I sure hope so. Let me take you over to our big black buckets of potatoes and show those. Here's all our pots still getting ready to set out. We've got our Swiss chard. I'm going to try to get it set out this weekend. And peppers are going to wait a little while. We have to find some space for them. Over here, the red Pontiac potatoes in these buckets have come up all the way through the, from the bottom. And they're looking good. I'm about to cover them back up. And I'm going to cover them till right up below the top leaves. So just a little bit of leaf is showing. And then we'll have many times left to cover these guys. And I went and got a thing of peat moss. For, it says for organic growing. So I've got peat moss and black cow. And I'm using this mixture. I just mixed up probably not even half and half. Well, probably about half black cow and half peat moss. But I'm going to take this and just put it around the potatoes and cover them up to where just a little bit of the leaf is showing and I'm almost to the top of this so I guess when we get to the top then we'll just let them grow but I'm going to cover up the rest of these potatoes and that's it I was just out here planting and I was about to cover the potatoes and I wanted to show them and I guess that's it. Thanks for watching.